All right, people. So this is the first week of the leak. So every single week before we begin, I'm going to go ahead and explain what happened in the previous week, how many points each team has, and, uh, you know, the placement they are. So, of course, this is the first week, so no one's earned any points, but I can just go ahead and tell you guys the division. So, here is the top division, or the YCS division. So, we have the Yuma Utopians, the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, the Kite Galaxy Sotons, and the Kaiba White Dragons, of course, all with zero points. And in the lower division, or the regionals division... We have the Yusei Star Dragons, the Yugi Dark Magicians, the Jack Red Arts Fiends, and the Zane Star Dragons, all with zero points, because of course it's the first week. So uh, next week I will go ahead and uh, update it, put first place, second place, third place, fourth place respectively, and update you each week about the points and the standings every single week. So I hope that you guys are excited for it. So be sure to support this video and all the videos in the league by liking and favoriting and spreading the word about this league. And, uh, yeah, enjoy. All right, people, welcome back to the league. So this is season one, week one, match episode. two. Yeah, match two. <laughs> That's two. two. So whatever. we got uh, Stu with the, 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 the Jack Red Arch Fiends, and he decided to go with his tier one deck. Yeah, he decided to use Burning Abyss versus Pops or uh, Apollo, uh, representing the Yuma Utopians using his tier one deck. Necros. <laughs> All right. <laughs> like, wow. Really? <laughs> tier 1 v one, so no one's getting any extra No that. one's getting any extra points. They're just fighting for one point. So I believe that Stu is in the lower division, and Pops, or Apollo here, is in the upper division. So here we go. So, yep. We, we see, of course, uh, this is before the list. It's the April list. So, yes, uh, Pops does have multiple shit gonna go ahead and use the shriet one of the shriets and then summon his valkyries so let's see let's see if that shriet down to one was a worthy hit you know so there's a lot to see and of course burning vest didn't get touched at all so but oh my god tier one be tier one. all right yep the tier one versus two i really thought they were going to be risky but i guess you know, Stu and Stu and uh, Pops do have a rivalry, so I guess they, apparently, apparently, I, I didn't know, I didn't know anything. I did not know about this. Did. Apparently, they have a rivalry, and they're just like, yeah, we, you know, we're we'll gonna go asses. all in, balls yeah. deep. No, we're gonna go balls deep. So we're gonna go ahead and see. So uh, will it be just like uh, the American Nationals, where uh, you know the Burning Abyss end up taking it, or what's up? They gonna go use the Valk Tribute to draw two. All right. Still going to his deck, and I know he's interesting. He's actually playing the, the sorcerer. The, yeah, the other ones, like the ones that weren't tributed to get that. So I guess this is more a Valk build than a Trish build. Mm -hmm. Interesting. It's not terrible. It's, if it's tributed, you get to go ahead and search for spellcasters. Oh, definitely. Spell he's are... got the potential there. Yeah, he gets... does. Oh, and then he gets another Valk. Yeah. And then you get the Trish unicorn. back. Oh, get um, the Brio yeah. back, and then... Search Trish. Yeah. Oh, he already has Trish in his hand. Oh. I thought, no, he pitched it, didn't he? Did, did he pitch it? I'm sure he pitched it, and he pitched the Sorcerer for okay. uh, Valk's effect. Alright, well, Stu's turn. Right. I, I want to see, I want to see this. I want to see it this. This should be good. This should be good. I really didn't think, I thought, you know, we gave you we give you an incentive to go ahead and use your lower tier decks and get more points. You're like, but... nope. Nope. Mulligan. Mulligan, oh, okay. Wow, alright. So he's going to go ahead and use his one Mulligan per All match, right. so no, no more Mulligan. No more mulligan, that's it. Nope. Uh, uh, Slate says he hates that. Yeah. He, say, he says that uh, pretty much he won't, he's like, oh, I can just make my deck more inconsistent now. Like, you only get well, one no, mulligan per match. Because then it just means that it's only one. It doesn't mean it, oh, every single game I can mulligan. Like, it just means you get it once. Once. So once if you make match. your deck in more inconsistent, like, then all you're going to do is you you might get get a shitty hand. You'll use your one mulligan. You might get a good hand, but it doesn't guarantee the other two games you're going to get, the, or the other game you're going to get a good hand. Exactly. So yeah. He's like, he's like, he's like, with my black wings, I'm going to mulligan until I get a black whirlwind. Like, no, it's only once. <laughs> it's only once, like, once calm per your tits. Match. Your... It's not yeah, even, like, match. once per not duel. Not game. Match. match. That's it. So, if this goes up to game three... You fuck. Get him with that crush card. Damn, we mulliganed into that crush card. The tower. Mm. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. <laughs> Damn. Get rid of that. <laughs> Damn. Wow. I mean, he's not out. But damn. I hurt. 
That hurt. That did hurt. That hurt. I, I feel you. I feel you, Pops. <laughs> mm-hmm. Jolly good show. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> But, that is quite marvelous, dear <laughs> Stu Sir Esquire. I tip my hat to you. <laughs> yeah. I, I I raise my monocle to you, sir. <laughs> tip tally ho. Uh, what <laughs> the fuck am I saying? I don't know. He just has to. He's the only one to name himself Pop, so can't can we not? <laughs> mm. So of course he's not out. The crush card hurt, but hey, he's not out. Oh God! Here we go. Here we go. Get get another search. Yep. <sighs> and of course, yes, we are using the April. Let's see. You probably want to know. Ooh, that but damn that number generator. You get fucked up. <laughs> yeah, that fucking <laughs> mull- mulligan into crush card and bottomless. <laughs> damn. So of course, like I said, this is the April list, so he does have multiple strats, but we did ban the Jijin, so there is no Jijin. Yeah, so no Jijin lock, so. And he does have the level of chain, so if he wants to do that, but I don't even know what you're doing if you go you don't have the Jijin. And yes, we confirmed the decks. All the decks mm-hmm. are checked. So and we have them on file, so If we see any cards that are not in those fucking decks. Oh man, I don't know. You're oh. automatically out the league. Which would suck because <laughs> like well, Then it means someone gets a buy. Yeah, it would just it would uh, it would just ruin it for everybody. Like that would just be terrible. Like yeah, but then again, it is just their fault for cheating. Like people don't cheat. Don't don't ruin it for don't, everybody. Don't don't try. Don't try it. Uh, damn, mm. and into your one fucking tour guide. He searched it. All oh, right. Okay. Yeah, Scarm. That's Scarm right. searched it. Oh yeah. He's gonna go ahead and drop that maxi. That's fine. So. So draw a card. Draw a card. Like don't make me babysit you. <laughs> Not in the league. Not no. even, not now. This isn't, this isn't fucking... I want this to be DM different DM than DM Bill commentary. <laughs> I actually not scrubs. What happened? Really really what? Really what? What happened? I don't know. Stu just typed really. Yeah, he just typed really. Like, what's up, Stu? Is something really? wrong? Really? I'm so lost. Me too. Hang on, what's going on? Seriously, what, uh, eh. So you didn't want to get him to get the additional draws, Dante. When he drew an MST, with the space at him. So... So you, he pretty much allowed him to even out with the Max C. Got rid of that Phoenix. So he's gonna go ahead and, uh... Get some more resources. Mm-hmm. What? I'm guessing you're saying really about the the maxi? I don't know. I guess. I guess. Because he main decks it, I guess? And he's like, who main decks that, I guess? I don't know. It's his deck, you know, it's the main deck it, he can main deck it. I'm not, personally, I'm not he a big, forgot, I'm not the biggest fan. He forgot crush card. When he watches my duels and corrects me on it. Oh, alright, okay. That's what Stu just said. Oh, what about crush card? Yeah, actually, yeah, what about crush card? It's only one turn. It's not three turns like it used to be, so he crash carded you, and that's it. Like, I understand. I would say, didn't you know that he had Max C because of a uh, crash card? I'm, I'm lost. I'm so lost. <laughs> what about crush card? You take no damage. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then there's the Trish. I don't okay. like Trish. Time to get wrecked. Yep. Yeah, I still hate Trish. I got fucking. I, tr- I got regular Trish on vitamin Y. I got regular Trish uh, today. Actually, I lost my Trish virginity. I I I, I don't like that card. I don't. I'm, I hate this list. I hate this list so much. I always hated Trish, and now it's back. I still hate it. Like from the competitive side, whatever. You know who's gonna play Trish? Who cares, right? But from a fucking Non that aside, it's annoying. It is. It's just like wow, like all right. The guy actually, I was fucking. He went and uh, tried. To, he went and trished me. And he, I pl- had Felgrand. I chained Felgrand effects on itself, and he's like, "Why isn't your Felgrand banished? Is Dove Pro glitched?" I'm like, "Read Felgrand." 
How do you not know what Falgrand does? Read the fucking Falgrand. And he, he's like, I can't get over that and scoop. So he trashed me. He couldn't get over my Falgrand because it's 100 points more and he scooped. Wow. Like, okay. But damn. I said, I don't think I don't think any trash should be legal. There, it's all unhealthy. All of them are evil. Yep. I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind trash from necros if fucking uh, shrit was banned. Like it's this entire tribute. Like, I know. Like if you want to tribute other shit for it. Fair enough, I guess. You know, you, using monsters that add up to level... Because it has to be, what? It has to be level 9. Exactly. Right? Exactly level 9, but it can't be of just a level 9 monster. Which makes it even harder since, you know... I would be uh, totally fine with just that. I would be totally fine with that. But when you can just still... Even straight at 1. With one straight, you can still just keep on using this entire tribute. So is, is it the entire tribute just period? And you search for a warrior? It's the entire... Uh, tribute, and then you search for a warrior, yeah. So, the tribute doesn't even have to be for a warrior necros monster, right? Nope, it can be for any. What about, uh, the other ones? What do you mean? Like, the, what does the one say that you can, if it's used as a tribute, then you get to search, can that be used as the full tribute, or is it only tribute that can be used as the full tribute? Uh, I think it's only tribute. I'm not too sure on necros, but damn, that main deck man crush. Damn. I have no idea what Pops is doing in his own his hand. Because he had to. For Mind Crush. But he called Trish. What happened to Trish? Yeah, Trish is at three. Right, right. Yeah? Oh, okay. Okay. So I guess he didn't have his <laughs> yeah. Necro's, tr Necro's Trish is at three, so if he calls it, he has to still confirm the hand, so that's why he revealed his hand. Yeah. Unless it's not at one. Unless it's at one. Yeah, unless it's If it's at one, there's no need to confirm, so that doesn't work. Unless he can confirm the locations of all of them, which of course he can't. You know, yeah. there's one on the field and there's one in his hand, so. But we don't know if he's playing more than one. Oh, Karma Court, damn. Book of Moon. And that's why I love Bookerman. Such a skillful so one, card. Yeah, it is. It, it's one of the best Negwans you can have in the game. Of it is. I love it because it's just such a good Negwan, but I also love it because it's like, unlike most cards, it's like Dark Hole. Just play it, get rid of my opponent's stuff if I don't have monsters, or I need to get rid of it really badly. Regeki, play it, you know, stuff like that. MST. There's a bit of skill in MST, but not that much. But Book of Moon, it's like a really nicely skillful card. Like, you can use Book of Moon, and then you can use... Book of Moon. Mm -hmm. And that's why I love it. Any cards that require skill to play to their maximum effect, I love. Even if I'm not skilled at playing them myself, I still love them. Yeah, he did attempt to attack. So, mm -hmm. so since he attempted to attack, he cannot flip up. If he didn't attack, then of course he could flip up, but no. Yep. So, is it Dante time? How mm. much is uh, Trish's booty? I don't even know how much. I, don't, I didn't even check how much Trish's booty was. Me neither. I think it's same stats as regular Trish, so hang on, let me find a regular Trish. You could just, wow. 2000. But say, why don't you just look at Necro as a Trish? <laughs> why do you gotta go all convoluted? It's the same thing, Josh. I, I don't know why you're just like, well, you know, it has the same exact stats as regular Trish, so let me go ahead and look at regular Trish and then compare and contrast the Necro as a Trish. Don't you just look I at couldn't be bothered, Trish? I couldn't be bothered typing Necros and searching for all the Necros cards. Just type in Trish and it comes up Trish or Necros Trish, though. It's easier. I'm lazy. Deal with it. How is that any. <clears throat> what? I'm dead. I don't understand how that's any easier than what you did Because before. you don't have to type necros and then scroll through all the fucking cards. You just, okay. you know, to find the necros of Trish, you just type Trish. Okay. And then only necros of Trish and Trish come up. Damn. I mean, I guess we should have known that they were going to come at each other with the tier 1 decks because of the rivalry, but I, I really thought they were at least going to have, you know, take the opportunity mm -hmm. to earn a couple of points. Oh, well. Guess not. So of course this means that next week whoever they face, you know, they cannot they cannot use that tier, tier one decks. Yep. Luna is the only person who used his non tier one. So, so on far, Luna. so far. Good on Luna. Yeah. We'll find out feeling, if anybody else sees the tier one. I have tier a feeling that week. most people are gonna use their tier ones first to try and get a point. Like you know what I mean? 
And then next the next weeks are going to probably use their tier 2 or 3. Probably some will use tier 3, some will use tier 2. This deck, <laughs> this duel though. This duel though. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Damn. Damn, yeah. Yeah, that Shrit has, nice Shrit has that. to be banned. Like, they don't have to ban Triss, just ban fucking shit. Damn. The I mean, is coming through. You get something, but... At 3300 beta, it's so nice. Mm-hmm. That's it. Is that... Am I going a little bit too harsh? Because look how many times they can just re recycle the shit. They can use... Well, even if... Uh, one, they can use it once to tribute from hand. If they have it in hand. They can use it from grave. For the full cost. Mm-hmm. You can get and it it's... back with Unicorn. Yeah. Some decks are playing Burial. Mm-hmm. I imagine people will play Rota, like I said. People will just swap out the two shrits they run in for Rotas to search Clawsless and Shrit. Why not? Why the fuck not? I would. I fucking would. <laughs> There's no reason not to. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. It's like, whoever said that fucking Necros got hit and that they're dead and shit, they're fucking stupid. I think the Cali effect did. No offense to the Cali effect, but I definitely know he's like, oh, well, Necros are dead. And then some people are like, oh, yeah, fucking Necros. They dropped down a tier. Like, wow. How? <laughs> Like, are you we, want uh, crap? Yeah, are we like, if, the if, same if fucking game. If Trish game? got banned, if Trish got banned, I could see it. Why people would say it? I don't think it would happen because they have other boss monsters. They have decisive armor. They have Valk. You know, they have Brio. They have other boss monsters. So taking Sh Trish out of the equation would hurt the deck. I'm not saying it wouldn't, but it wouldn't necessarily bump Necros to tier two. They'd still be tier one. They just won't be as tier one. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You know. But it'd solve one of the problems, but yeah, so I could see if people were, if it was Necros or Trisha got a ban this list and people were like, Oh yeah, Necros dropped down to tier two. I don't think they would have, but I could see why people would say it, but really? Shri oh oh Shri went from three to one. When they only played Nec two. Necro Necros are dead, like Are you on crack? <laughs> like, did you get dropped on your head at birth? Alright. Anyway, special summon, normal summon, special summon, special summon, special yeah. summon. Special she summon. hasn't even special touched summon. pop, so that is yet. No, Necro's power of him too good. Yeah. There's the Dante. The attach. Multiple no spheres. Still untouched, running abyss. Yeah, I don't know why. Because they can. Wow, beautiful mills. Yeah. Because they can, because they're like, fuck it, this is the world's list, and, you know, it's not like Burning Abyss are going to be our world, so why hit them? Yep. Yep. Um, and that is one of the reasons I don't play meta, because it's stupid. I mean, they're, they're fighting play, pretty I... hard for one point. We're already 17 minutes in this video, and it's still game one. <laughs> wow. Like, they, they're going fucking ham. I'm just going to go ahead and make the Zen main crash into it, destroy the Slicer armor. It's fine. Finally, some damage on Pops. Holy shit. So you're going to take Pops. 16. Ouch. No, 17. Pops. And... Pops. Why Why did Pops lose 900? I know. Hold up. Hold up. Let me, let me <laughs> go ahead and message Pops and be like, um... <laughs> are, you sure, are you sure this isn't the end all commentary? Um... <laughs> 2500 minus 14 equals. <laughs> Come on, SpongeBob. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> hmm. Mm. <laughs> I wonder what it equals. Thank if you. <laughs> minus 14. Like, damn, like, mm -mm, I want to be a math teacher too. Like, mm mm. <laughs> Really, there go. <laughs> wait, wait, he's lost more life points. Why have you lost 200 more? He's supposed to lose 200 more. Alright. Damn, you didn't even know the math was wrong either? At least I'm fucking drunk. I've got an excuse. <laughs> What's he got? Like 25 excuse? minus 14 equals? <laughs> Come on. It's first grade, SpongeBob. <laughs> 25 minus. 
Like, if you had 1,600, then yeah, it'd be 900. <laughs> yeah. But of course, Pop ain't out of this deal yet. The power of the Necro is Yeah, I wasn't thinking mirror. of Dante. I was thinking fucking uh, Zen Mains attack the bloody uh, Manju. That's why I was saying 100 for a minute. I was like, it's oh, 100. Right. Like, wait, wait, no. Zen Mains attack the other good one. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so... Like when Pop you when you con when you confuse a fucking Dante for a Zen mains, that's when you know you've had. Can too I have much. some? What did you drink? <laughs> <laughs> Beer, and then I went into vodka. Damn, vodka. I still like haven't. I still like haven't drink. Russian wow. Bull. Yes. Like, damn. Game one over. Still takes it. Whew. That was a good duel. That was a good duel. That was a good. One. I want to see who wins this. All right. Well, I ho hopefully I'm not. Hopefully it's Stu. Not because I want Pops to lose, but because I'm probably going to keep getting my vid now from this point on. So if you hear any sudden silence, yeah, I had to mute my mic because <laughs> it's like I want to. I want like it's late now. It's fucking five past one in the morning. Let's go. I'm like, oh wait, shush. Right. League, go away. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we're gonna come back after they're done fighting. All right, people. So we are back. So, so pops, pops, going is, first. pops going first. You know, you're talking. They were just talking about the power of the mulligan. Oh yeah, Stu was uh, like, "Oh yeah, thanks, mulligan." Like, yeah, yeah right, that's helped. fine. Yeah. See, and was that all not entertaining, Slate? Were you not entertained? <laughs> 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 yeah, I thought it was entertaining. I thought it was a good. I duel. thought it was a good duel. Yeah, it was. I thought Stu was fucked, and then he came back. Like, damn. Very nice, Pops very nice ready. job there. So I wonder, I wonder, I wonder what Pops sided in. A little bit of shadow imprisoning, huh? <laughs> a little bit of hate. Let's go, Pops. Go. Gotta go fast, like Sanic, the Hog Huge. <laughs> Still mad at Game Grumps. I'm sorry, that's off topic, but damn, <laughs> damn. <laughs> Nothing, huh, Pops? Pops, How? did you open up bad? Pops. How? In Necros? How? Mmm. Half the deck is Hold on. Oh. Damn. Special summon it... tribute summon focus. Like, wow. Wow. Did you even forget about fucking, Mulligan? Even, yeah, even fucking Denko didn't get over this. We Mulligan? gave you we gave you the Mulligan rule. I said, did you open up bad? He said, yup, but didn't do use Mulligan. Now it's too late. You yeah, have to do it in your late. initial hands. Too late now. Yeah. So, no. No. Wow. He's mulliganing. Uh, you know what? So let stupid. Him. Fucking let, let him. Fucking well, let next him. Time, like, tell dude. Him. <sighs> for next. For next time, you can't just mulligan whenever when it Fucking has want. to be opening hand. Damn. Only. Oh my god. I thought we explained this pretty fucking clearly. I thought we did too. We like we told them like you get one mulligan, it's per match, not per game, and you can only use it your initial hand. Is that it? Oh, okay, whatever. Oh yeah, search for your spell card which you can't fucking play. Yeah. Show me what you got. Break through scale. Eat a day. Wow, even fucking worse. Damn, like, oh, damn. Okay. Sue's, Sue's got this. This is it. This is it. Nah, nah, man. GG. Nah. G, G fucking G. G fucking G. That's it. That's it. Right, done. Necros, no spell cards. You fucking didn't get a search either. G fucking G. Damn. Like, get wrecked. Mm hmm. Spread your butt. Show me your butt. <laughs> damn. Oh, you got six cards in hand. Damn. And you mulliganed, even though you shouldn't have been able to, you mulliganed. Yep, yeah, and you uh, still got nothing. And you still got nothing. Damn. Yeah. And mind you. Mind you. Fucking fiendish chain him. Fiendish chain him, go. Damn! <laughs> <laughs> Damn! <laughs> oh! Ah! Oh, it hurts! Oh! Damn! Get wrecked! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! Oh yeah! Stu takes a point! Yeah, and Stu gets a point! 
So fuck yo necros. Damn. Oh, that's fuck oh my God. Wow. yo necros. That what mm. the hell was that other face down? I don't even know. But damn. Uh, that fiend card that that's him send a fiend type monster from his deck to graveyard to banish a card in the graveyard. Fiend, what's oh. it called? Fiend something. Fiend some. I don't know, fiend something. Yeah, so that's a good name. Fuck it. Yeah, fiend something. I forgot. I want to say fiend comedian, but that's not right. Damn. I want to say right. fiend sanctuary, but I, I don't think that's right. That's not it either. <laughs> fiend, fiend something. Anyway, there you go, people. So. I huh? hope that you guys enjoy. I was gonna get. I was gonna. I was gonna take ages. <laughs> I thought it was. I thought it was. But it's over. In spell counselor, oh, breakthrough skill on your man, on your fucking send you, and then mistake on your man. Like, ow. Yeah. So of course, uh, Stu wins the point for this week, and Pops gets nothing. So uh, of course, Pops gets nothing. Put the clip in. <laughs> no, no. So no. Uh, I will, of course, every single week, you guys have already seen the intro, every single week I update you guys on the previous week of what happened, so next week you will go ahead and see the points line up, but so far, that's, this is uh, match two, so uh, Stu is in the lower division, yeah, mm -hmm. Stu is in the lower division, so he gets one point in the lower division, so we got what Pop is in the upper division, so we still got two more matches that you guys will be getting tomorrow, so I hope that you guys are enjoying the league. Uh, be sure to show your support by liking the video, favoriting the video, and uh, uh, check out everyone in else's channels yeah, as well. Check out everybody else's channel. Links will be in the description, of course. So, uh, thank you, Sanzu, for joining me. No problem. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And we will we'll see you guys tomorrow with two more matches uh, for the first week of the league. All right, people. Thanks for watching. Yeah.